Alright, so today's are for the attach for uh, my gear. So first up is gonna be the guns and then I'll do what I wear. Um so yeah. <clears throat> Alright, so the first gun is my MP7. Um it has the uh stock, um kind of flimsy, but you know, it works. Um then it also has uh flip up sights. Like that. And um, then it also has the grip right here. Um, battery goes in right here. This piece just comes off like that. Um, and then it also has my laser mod. Um, and it's perfectly in line with the sights. So as you can see. Right there. So wherever the laser is, your BBs go. So yeah, it's great for like close quarters cause so you can just sort of hold it like this you know <clears throat> and I can also put my flashlight on the side um, which also has a laser um, That's but that's a different story and then I can also put my suppressor on like that alright and then next up is my Cold. Um, wood grips I made for it. Um, and then two mags. So sort of just like this. Yeah. <clears throat> I also got the grenade. Really handy. And um, I have a little pouch to show that, and you can just shoo, shoo, toss it. Um, this is my MBO5. What is it doing? MBO5, um, 6x9x40, mil dot, red, uh, red green illuminated crosshair scope. Um, also has a laser on the side as well, which is, I think it's like, yeah. It's uh, eight mils to the left, eight mils down, um, and it's always like that. Um, scope covers come down. Um, so yeah, and then I can also put my bipod on it right here. Then it's my SR25. Um, right now it's in CQB mode. Um, it doesn't have any iron sights, of course, but you re you don't need them because you can just look right down the um, rail because it's all of them can um, continuous rail actually not except for that little piece but it's all continuous I also have a sling on it just to you know just a two point <coughs> then I can also put bipod on it right here flashlight right here <coughs> grip right here Suppressor, quick detachable, right there. And then scope, right here. I'll do a little assembled thing. So, yeah. Alright, so this is what it's like all together. Um, as you can see, really cool. Check this side. So, yeah. And um, together, it's about 12 and a half pounds. Um, so, yeah. Let's see. So yeah, pretty cool. Um, and it's got the same scope as the MBO5, just a uh, giant ash sunshade. And then the bipod flips down, and then also extends. You really just can't. Last but not least is my AK. What is that? <laughs> Same kind of situation as well. Um, so yeah, this is just like just by itself. Um, and I can also put my scope attachment on, which just. Flip 
Let's put this thing down. Like that. And then we also got the uh, threaded spresser. I'm not gonna put it, I, yeah, I'll put it on the way so it doesn't fall off. I guess. I also got another sling. I don't know, it's just a pain to put a bag on. But it clips on right here. And, uh, right here. So yeah, that's that. And it's a 3x9x40. Um, just a crosshair scope. And I uh, cut out some of the crosshairs so it's like sort of customized. And then I also got the uh, mid cap. The high cap. I had another mid cap, but it was really effed up. Wonder where that was from. And um, so I had to completely take it apart. And taking it apart, I had to completely destroy it. And completely, not like I ripped it. I completely destroyed it. And um, figured out how it worked. It's really, really tricky how they did it. Um, wouldn't suggest it though, because you can ruin your gun. Doing, you're ruining the mag doing that. <coughs> and um, last but not least. 18 inch machete. This is real. Um, I'm just kidding. I don't use this to play with. But if it's like a backyard game, I'll wear it because it's kind of like cool. So you can just like, 